My name is Insane Raven, and I am back with Psychonauts. And oh my god, um, I've managed to destroy everything. Man. Um, I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. That's awesome. Oh my god! Um, definitely not what I expected to happen in this virus. But I guess I should have known better. I guess I, I should have. I should have figured this is what was gonna happen. I don't know why I didn't, but I didn't. And I'm a dumb person for that. So before we kind of go on forward, I want to go backwards because now we have the. Uh, we have the duffel bag, emotional baggage, and I want to know what goes on the, in the head of a fish. So, <coughs> in the last episode, we uh, we beat up a giant fish that stole Lily. Um, apparently Lily is trapped in the fish's subconsciousness because Psychonauts. I don't understand this game anymore. <laughs> I'm not even gonna try to pretend like I do. I, I don't. Um. It's just like I don't understand what emotion the duffel bag is supposed to be because we have a sad box like we have sadness as a, as a thing and we have hate box so I, I just really don't know what is happening um okay so we have two tags the purse is actually inside that new location we just unlocked I know this because I saw it, and I saw it. Like I'm trying to think of other things to talk about, just the kind of like the past of time as we're walking through. But by the time this video goes out, hopefully, all the things will be like fixed in a way. As I said, well, you're gonna open. Longfish Opolis under siege. All the fishies were having fun one day, and then the- What? What the fuck is that? Oh, okay. He's an overlord. He's an evil overlord. Okay. That totally made sense and was not at all questionable. There it is. Excellent. There it is. Okay, so that's the blimp. The blimp is important to me for some reason. I have completely forgotten why the blimp is important to me. I'm not even going to kind of pretend to know why the blimp is important to me. I now have the purse, which is awesome. I'm gonna skip that because we have seen that so many times. It kinda hurts my head to continue to watch that. Freedom! 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 You're the stone fish. So this fish number three is the stone of fish. That is what we've concluded. Fish number three is the stone of fish. Doesn't look like much to me. Come on, let's blow this joint. Hey, you're welcome. Sorry about him, Gargalor. He's been in prison a long time. He's the only pilot the resistance has, and he has an excellent plan. Meet us at the dam so we can put it into action. Okay. You're flying away. Wait, are you supposed to be flying away? I feel like you're supposed to be flying away for some reason. Okay. So now I have to meet them at the dam. Cause damn! Son! Oh yeah, so I'm going to use the blimp to get over the dam. I feel like this is... Like... There's a part of me that's like, yeah, this is normal. Like, this would... What would obviously happen next. And there's the other part of me that's like, dude, you're in the head of a fish. None of this is normal. You need to go get your life checked out again. Because none of this is normal. And yet for somehow, this is 100% normal for us. Like...
I don't know why that didn't happen the first time. I feel like it should have. But it didn't for some reason. Okay. I was being nice. Now you both blow up. Um. Ha! Now you see the genius of our plan, Gogalore. First we print flyers. Then we spread them all over town with my blimp. Winning over the hearts and minds of Lungfishopolis in as soon as six months. Bro, you don't have a town. Six months? You don't like our plan, you can come up with another one. Yes, we're busy. We have to select cardstock and then find a decent but inexpensive printer within the week. I don't think that's gonna work. Oh. Care to tell me why that wouldn't work? No! Awesome! That was totally a 100% my plan all along. See, that's why you don't mess with Gaga Lord. Can I jump? Thank you, I wanna jump. Thank you. I'm over the day you reach skyscraper island. This is just gonna get more and more obnoxious as we go along, isn't it? I really have a feeling this is gonna get more and more obnoxious as we go along. Do I do I have that one yet? I do. I'm gonna pick this up. Pick up hate box. Why why do all of them cry? Why is that what all of them do? Why do you all cry? Like I get that you emotional baggage and all that crud, but I mean you don't all have to be pissing crying babies. Alright, so what was that again? Did I get like more life or did I get more lives? I completely forgot what that's for. And I feel like I need that. Hey, I can get that. Just jump over here. Careful, over my chai tea! Yes. Was it worth it? Maybe not, but at least we got to hear that man yell my cr my chai tea. Also, he's not a man. He's a giant fish-like person. I would do well to remember that. There are no men in this land. Only fish. What am I doing with my life? Why am I playing a PS2 era game? Like, why is this what I decided to do? Swan. I have so many questions for myself. Like, I don't even want to know what you guys are thinking about me right now. I don't want you shooting him. Oh god! Man. So that's actual water. Don't go near the actual water, lest we do. Because actual water tends to kill us. Because, you know, we have hydrophobia. Which, to me, I've always found that to be a weird ass phobia. Like, you're afraid of water. I don't know, I just think that's oddly specific. Like, are you only afraid of water that, like, you can drown in? Or are you afraid of all water? Am I just kind of bigoted and I don't really understand your way of life? Maybe. Probably. Like, I guess that's just not my thing, so I can't like I wouldn't be able to like relate. But it, I don't know, to me it just seems like a really weird thing to be afraid of, I guess. Yo, your bullet just went through a building. Hammer shield up. Totally hammer shield up. I just love playing Godzilla right now. 
Like, I know we have a mission and we're supposed to be doing a thing, but, like, just... I'm destroying so much. It makes me happy. Hey! And there's so much health here that, like, I can take as many bullets as this dude wants to throw me. It's awesome. Watch it! I feel like I was good on that second one, but you know what? Whatever. Go. There's always a second one. There's always a second one. Don't know if you guys are any big fans of Pink out there, but I mean, I have a song from her stuck in my head, and it's weird because like it's an older song. Like, to me, it's a new song, so I'm like, yeah, that song's so awesome, but I feel like if I talk about it, like, say what the song is. Actually, has Pink even made any new music recently? Like, recently that I could, like, talk about Pink and not be like, oh, yeah, no, he's listening to really old-ass music. I don't think so. What? Yep. There's so many missiles. Don't shoot, don't shoot me, baby. You know what? I was nice, but now I'm gonna destroy everything. Just. Is it just me, or do I really love that, like, this is inside of a fish's head? Like, I kind of thought that this, if anywhere, like, this would be where we get, like, our underwater level from the game. Nope. I was gonna say, shouldn't this be hurting me somehow? I feel like it should be hurting me. More breaking news! We're here with the star of the popular sitcom Trouble in the Bubble, Buddy Finn. <laughs> Buddy, what's your take on the Gogamore situation? Is he just misunderstood? No way! I hate Gogalore! I can't imagine any one of my fans siding with the monster. He hates everything lungfish care about. Air, water, family, the economy. <laughs> Buddy, you'll be happy to know that the Navy has decided to pull out what they're most famous for. Airplanes! <laughs> so what? assured, we can all look forward to Gogalore's imminent death. And to seeing you, buddy, every Thursday night at 8, right here on LBC. Thanks, and I'd just like to add just that saying if anyone I really kidnaps want to a human child, they should take them quickly under the lake to the abandoned insane asylum. Gogalore, come in. We have commandeered these vessels in your name. We can put them in position to help you cross Kochamara Channel to get to Kochamara Island and destroy Kochamara Tower. The thing is that, um, although we have the utmost faith that you will- You are not closing your mouth. Gagalore, that bothers we, me so much. Uh... And you're not talking to maintain our position out here. Just until you clear the area of all hostiles. Yes. For insurance reasons, Gagalore. Yes, that, and for freedom. Am I the only one really annoyed that the mouths weren't closing? Their mouths weren't closing, but they were talking. But their mouths weren't closing. Oh god. So am I just supposed to have the planes like run into me? I mean, they destroyed one of them, so... Seems like a good plan. Mainly because I also have no freaking clue where the other one- Okay, so I need to get up here.
That is a thing over there, and I want that thing. What? Hey! What? Freedom! I got that? Oh god, I feel like that's not how that should have happened. But freedom! That's how you know this is not an American game. Can you guys leave me alone now? I really, really want to get that stupid, like, golden helmet. It's beautiful and I want it. Give it to me. I also want to go over there and get that normal helmet. Normal helmets, maximum projection, depth increase. It's an awesome helmet. Okay. Now, I think it was over here that I saw the emotional baggage. This game has been caring about the emotional baggage of a fish. <laughs> Let's just get that out of the way. I just took care of the emotional baggage of a fish. What am I doing with my life? Can I just say, it's such a weird thing to think about, but like, draw distance is a thing in this game. Like, it's an actual thing in this game. So like, no, go, go on. Okay. Oh, there's a duff, there's a bag over here? Peace out, I guess. Oh, God. That sucks. I kind of came like all this way over for that. That's fine. I'll just destroy everything. Wait, there's a. Yeah, no. I want that boat. I'm not gonna save you. Lungfish and the bottle. He's a tiny little fish watching TV. He's got caught by a man and he's evil. And he's experimenting. And he's evil. Now he's giant. Oh, wait, that's. So Orlando's in on it. So Orlando is evil too. Okay. Like, like we knew he was using. Uh, oh God! Like we knew Coach Orlando was uh, broadcasting shit, but we didn't know he was like in on it. If I'm 100% honest, I thought Orlando was like being mind fucked by the dad scientist dude. If I'm 100% honest, I will own up to that. Well, we're sorry to report that the miserable and incompetent lug-faced Navy is all but sunk. Great work, losers. Now, Kochamara himself will have to come all the way down here just to save our worthless hides. Authorities are calling for a big parade in Kochamara's honor after he clobbers the annoying giant Gagalore. And if the parade is big enough, Chamara promises not to destroy the city. Brush teeth more often don't drool so much. Well, wasn't that refreshing? Hey everyone! Here comes Kochamara! Real quick, dude, what are you? What what are you? I don't understand you. Dude, this is like a boss fight, right? Ha ha! I know karate moves and splits and other things. Ho ha ha! I can backflip and splits. And I am in serious pain now. 
But not really, because I don't know what puberty is. Give up while you can, Gogalor! I know it's you in there, Coach. I don't know where you're broadcasting from, but I'm gonna find out and make you show me what happened to Lily. Kojamara does not speak giant monster boy language. The only word you're gonna need is ouch. My Am I supposed to be doing something? Triangle beam. Okay. Mighty ram. Mighty ram. Deadly triangle beam. Oh, okay. So I have to just shoot him then. This is a strange game. Yeah. This is an odd game. Mighty Ram! I don't know if I've said this enough, but this is an odd game. Deadly. Hmm. So Sasha showed you how to save up your aggressive energy, huh? Well, why don't I help you? Let it all out. Um, I need that. Mighty. Ground vision. I don't think that's gonna early intracabination. Hard to avoid. Area attack. Mighty round ground vision. Mighty round ground vision. Hard uh, hold on, I have to change my shit. <laughs> Don't think pyrokinetic maybe to the pieces. Area attack! Overly intricate combination! Hard to avoid! Ouch. Coach! 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 Mighty round! I have an idea. Ground vision! Hard to avoid! Oh, come on! Mighty Ram! Deadly Triangle Beam! Deadly Triangle Beam! You took all my you took all my ammo, you Mighty douche. Deadly Triangle Beam! Triangle beam! Mighty Ram! Deadly Triangle beam! Deadly Triangle beam! I don't think that's gonna work. I don't think that's gonna work. Deadly Triangle beam! Mighty Ram! Maybe I should let him hit me. Deadly triangle beam. Oh, that. Deadly triangle beam. Oh. That would work. Yep. Mighty ram. What? Deadly triangle beam. Okay, I need to Mighty do a small. Mighty ram. Come on, come on, come on. Deadly Mighty round grapple! Ah. Overly intricate combination! Hard to avoid! Area attack! Oh. Oh. You're mine! You're mine, coach! You're mine, you weird, pumply man. People of Lungfishopolis, I'm sorry I let you down. You were such a weird. Okay, Tower, get ready for Gogalore. Well, he was evil, but he did build a lot of roads.
Yeah, right after I pick up all these arrowheads. I mean, Jesus. I have to climb this? Totally have to climb this. I should have figured that I had to use the shield to, shield to like repel it because when you think about it, like that was the ability I got in this world level thing, so it just makes sense. It just makes good sense. It makes good video game sense. You're an idiot. You're a complete idiot. Take control of this freaky toad. I don't need him to nap children for me anymore. I've got the brain of a little girl back in my lab that's strong enough to power a whole army of psychoblaster death tanks. Huh? What? You've got the brain of a little girl? I said, in my lab. I think you've got the muscles of a little girl, too. <laughs> <laughs> I'm ten. Good one. I am a god! Bow down and worship me. Yep, I'm evil. Human child. <laughs> Who is that? Fish, don't talk to I, me. the creature whose spirit was once, um, <clears throat> over here, behind you. Yes. Fish, why are you talking to me? The creature whose spirit was once enslaved by the evil one. You have unchained my soul, and now I shall repay you, powerful human child. Oh, uh, great. Powerful human child. Okay. Pretty sure those words have never been spoken really? before. By the drowned spirit of Oblongata, it is done. <laughs> you ate me. You weren't supposed to eat me. Oh, I'm at the I'm at the evil layer now. Awesome. When it is your wish to travel across the lake, you may return to either shore and summon me with that. Thanks, hulking lungfish. You know, you really aren't as hideous as people say. You may call me now by my true name, Rasputin. The name given to me by and what name is that noble lake creature? Linda. Linda. What magical lady. Linda the longfish. All right. This episode did not. This went weird. This this went weird. Um. So thank you guys for watching. My name is Vincent Raven. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next episode of Story Time. Bye bye.